Hey, this is Darren from Old Forge Brewing Company, and we conducted a survey on social media, which just so happens to align with a certain basketball tournament that takes place in March, to decide what our next beer was gonna be. And the winner was Pale Ale. In addition to the survey we conducted on social media, we also had a contest for the best bracket for this basketball tournament that happens to take place in March, and the winner would get to decide the name of the beer. Now the winner was Dave Tocek, and he decided to name it Davy's Gravy. So when I was designing Davy's Gravy, I knew that I had to start with a pale ale, but I wanted to do something slightly different than tea rail or anything we've done in the past. So what I did is I made it a little bit lighter, and I gave it a little more finishing body and a little bit of the tropical fruit flavors that you get from the now popular New England or hazy IPAs. So it's not gonna be a hazy pale ale, but it is gonna have some of those flavor elements to try to bring some of those new flavors into an old style. Now this isn't gonna be as dark as something like Tea Rail. Tea Rail is a very malty, more English inspired pale ale. This is gonna be more of like a West Coast IPA inspired pale ale, but with those tropical fruit hops in it. Let's give it a try. All right, so right up front, I'm definitely getting the more uh, tropical fruit hop characters from it. The aroma is very, very hop centric. Don't get a lot, of <clears throat> a lot of maltiness from it. All right, the flavor is a little more balanced. So as being a pale ale, it's definitely got a little bit of malt sweetness to it. Um, it's definitely got those, those tropical fruit characteristics to it. A little bit resiny hop character kind of finishes with like a nice, clean, subtle bitterness. What I think I like about this is that it's a really well-balanced beer. It doesn't have, you know, one flavor that dominates over everything else, but it takes all those different flavors, like a little bit of grapefruit, tropical fruit, um, citrusy kind of flavors, a little bit of hot bitterness and resiny flavors, and couples it with just like the right amount of just light malt sweetness. Gives it a really good balance, really super drinkable. Uh, gonna be great for spring, which is perfect timing. Now the weather's starting to get a little nicer. Um, this is just gonna be you know, a great beer for this time of year. So there it is, Davy's Gravy on tap for the first time this week. Uh, come on and give it a try, thank you.